Let's go ahead and talk about Gurgaon for a rapid life. Gurgaon gets its infrastructure upgrade as Rapid Metro's Phase 2 began operations, providing a big relief to people living and working on this stretch. This will make commute to golf course and golf course extension road easier and will help in decongesting uh, vehicular traffic on these roads. The line starts from Sikandarpur metro station that is connected to the Delhi metro's yellow line near Bristol Chalk and terminates at golf course extension T-junction. The second phase of rapid metro has five stations. Our colleague Ashmika Singh spoke to the MD of ILNFS Rail, the company which is responsible for building and running the rapid metro. Rapid Metro Gurgaon South Extension commences operations today. I'm joined by Mr. Rajiv Banga, uh, who will tell us more about uh, the new route that has been involved uh, in this process. Um, this is the second phase of our Rapid Metro project, uh, which we are launching today, the commercial operations. Uh, we will connect our station at Sikandarpur uh, along the golf course road to the far end, which is sector 55-56. This is an alignment of about 6.6 .6 kilometers and will have five new stations. We are not releasing all the five stations today. Three new stations are being released today. We started construction in November 2013. So we've taken about three years and four months, which is uh, quite uh, reasonable for any projects of this nature. The challenges typically for any infrastructure project in the public space is to do with land acquisition and underground utilities. In our specific case, uh, uh, Huda, which is the authority on behalf of government of Haryana, I think uh, land on this patch happened quite well. But uh, utilities were quite a challenge. Uh, specifically, we had to deal with relocating an underground gas pipeline, which was uh, Bharat Petroleum's and a 66 kV underground uh, line. Uh, so these were the two big ones because uh, uh, they were the ones which determined the uh, timelines. Are all the safety measures taken and uh, everything, all the check, everything is done? Yes, indeed. Uh, in fact, that is the most paramount thing for a technology intensive project like this, that the reliability of the system, safety of the equipment and people together, uh, in both at the same level, uh, are paramount and uh, cannot be compromised at all. Right, and um, uh, how much uh, increase uh, do you expect in the ridership after this new route? We'll take it as it comes. We'll wait for uh, people to embrace the system and look at it as an opportunity to uh, move from uh, the conventional modes which they've been using to a mass transit system.